Hi guys. Welcome to Science Info District. Let's see. Russia Top Aircraft Carrier Since Russo-Ukrainian War is an ongoing international conflict between Russia and Russian-backed separatists against Ukraine, which began in February 2014, Russia has gone through massive upgradation in armaments. Russia has also improved its naval warfare including submarines, ships, and aircraft carriers. The Kuznetsov-class aircraft carrier, also known as the Project 1143.5, is a class of Russian aircraft carriers. It is named after Admiral Nikolai G. Kuznetsov, who was a Soviet naval commander during World War II. The Kuznetsov-class carrier was designed as a successor to the Kiev-class carriers and was intended to be the flagship of the Soviet Navy. The Kuznetsov-class carrier is a large and powerful warship with a displacement of around 59,500 tons. It is powered by two nuclear reactors, which allow it to travel at speeds of up to 30 knots or 56 kilometers per hour. The carrier is capable of carrying a total of 41 aircraft, including a mix of fighter jets, attack planes, and helicopters. It is also equipped with a range of advanced radar and communication systems, as well as a variety of defensive and offensive weapons. Here are some key features of the Kuznetsov-class aircraft carrier. Before we continue, please subscribe and press bell icon. 1. Design and Size the Kuznetsov class aircraft carrier is 305 meters, 1,000 feet long, 72 meters, 236 feet wide, and has a draft of 10 meters, 33 feet. Its displacement is around 59,500 tons, which makes it one of the largest and most powerful aircraft carriers in the world. Carrier comprises 3,857 rooms, including 1690 ship's crew members' residencies, gym, small hospital, storeroom, canteen, barber shop, and other facilities of life. The design of Admiral Kuznetsov class implies a mission different from that of the United States Navy's carriers. The term used by its builders to describe the Russian ships is Tyazali Avianeshishi Kraser, which means heavy aircraft carrying cruiser, intended to support and defend strategic missile carrying submarines, surface ships, and naval missile carrying aircraft of the Russian Navy. The carrier is equipped with a range of advanced radar and communication systems, including the MR-710 Frigate MAE Air Search Radar, the Granite 3D Surface Search Radar, and the MP-408 Fire Control Radar. It also has a variety of electronic warfare systems, including the TK-25E5 Jamming System. 2. Air Group and Crew The carrier is designed to carry a total of 43 aircraft, including a mix of fighter jets, attack planes, and helicopters. In the original project specifications, the ship should be able to carry up to 33 fixed-wing aircraft and 12 helicopters. The primary aircraft carried are Sukhoi Su-33 fighters, naval variants of the Sukhoi Su-27 flanker. The carrier has been fitted with a ski jump ramp, which allows it to launch fighter jets without the need for a catapult. It has two aircraft elevators and a flight deck that is 265 meters long and 53 meters wide. The carrier has a crew of 1,690 sailors and officers. This includes the 626 air group, 40 flag staff and other officers and personnel. 3. Armaments and Power the Kuznetsov-class carrier is equipped with a range of defensive and offensive weapons. It has 12 P-700 granite anti-ship missiles, as well as a variety of anti-aircraft guns and missile launchers. The carrier is also equipped with torpedo tubes for underwater defense. 
The carrier is powered by two nuclear reactors, which generate a total of 200,000 horsepower. This allows the carrier to travel at speeds of up to 30 knots, around 35 miles per hour or 56 kilometers per hour. The Kuznetsov class carrier is primarily used for power projection and naval air support. It is capable of carrying out a range of missions, including air defense, anti-submarine warfare, and surface warfare. The carrier is also capable of launching airstrikes against land targets. The Kuznetsov class carrier has undergone a number of refitting and modernization programs since it was first commissioned in 1990. These upgrades have included improvements to its propulsion system, electronic systems, and weapon systems. 4. Limitations Despite its many strengths, the Kuznetsov class carrier has a few limitations. Its propulsion system has been known to be unreliable, which has resulted in a number of breakdowns and delays. In addition, the carrier's air group is not as capable as those of some other aircraft carriers, such as the United States Navy's Nimitz-class carriers. 5. Cost The Kuznetsov-class carrier cost around 5.5 billion U.S. dollars. The Kuznetsov-class carrier has undergone a number of refitting and modernization programs since it was first commissioned in 1990. It's hard to guess its cost now. What do you think which country has the best aircraft carrier in the world? Let us know in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more interesting videos.